gonna give you some tip. Oh. Oh. I had a little crook in my neck and went to my head. God, don't take me out like that. This is my life. This is my life. This is, this is, this is my life. This is my dream. Can't nobody tell me who I'm supposed to be. This is your Maze TV. What's poppin' y'all? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I'm gonna be giving you guys tips on moving to Los Angeles. Because I don't want y'all to be like I did. Because I didn't know nothing about the city. I knew nothing. I just knew I wanted to be an actor. I knew the bit, most of the business was out here. So I was like, this is where I need to be. But I'm gonna give y'all some tips. Just in case you wanna move to LA, you know. But uh, these are my tips. Take them or leave them at the end of the day. Okay, so tip one. I would say... At least at a minimum, at the minimum amount, at least have like 5,000 saved up. I would say the minimum. That's the minimum amount. Of course, people can make it out, whatever. You know, just 5,000. Have it in the save because, you know, stuff happens. You know, you got to get your apartment. You got to do a lot of stuff. You got a lot of stuff to do. Okay? All right, second, I would say find you an apartment. Like, I would definitely recommend doing this while you're like, at, before you move out here, like find your apartment, find your roommate. That way when you get here, you don't have to live in a hostel or uh, Airbnb. What's some things called? Air, uh, Airb oh, Airbnb. In case you don't have to live in the Airbnb and stuff like that, you know, because that can that, that can dip into your 5000 So you don't want to do that. You want to already have your apartment, already have that stuff lined up even before you get out here. You know, this that's my recommendation. Then you're going to need to get a job because you can't have no money coming in because that 5000 will go real quick. That might get you through a month, two months, you know, that'll give you a little grace period. Um, you know, it's expensive out here. I'm gonna want, it's expensive. It ain't a, this, this city ain't for the week. You gotta grind. You gotta be on your hustle, you know? You wanna survive. Like, people make it like it's all rich. You know, you gotta be on your hustle. So get a job. Wherever you got a waiter, restaurant, that's the same thing. Get a job. I will also say, get a car. You're gonna need a car. Get a car because the transit here sucks. Like, uh-uh, I tried to ride it one time, I ended up somewhere. No, don't do it, bad idea. Get a car, you're gonna need a car, roll through the city, okay? Get your car, I'm warning you. You're gonna also need to prepare for the traffic. Like, the traffic is terrible. The traffic is ridiculous. I'm it took me a minute to learn about the traffic. Like, I would be late everywhere because I didn't know how the city worked. So, get, get your, you know, learn the traffic. Because if something says it takes 30 minutes to get there, it's probably going to take you like an hour or an hour and a half. That's real. Like, the traffic is ridiculous. Like, my road rage done got so bad since I've been out here, I'd be ready to go off. Be in jail messing around with me. Don't rob them. Don't not rob me if you can't fight. Because I cut people off that make you do it. I would also say, do your research. Like, research certain cities because I didn't know nothing about LA when I moved here. I didn't know nothing about the city. I just knew Hollywood. I didn't know North Hollywood. I didn't know West Hollywood. I didn't know none of that stuff. Research a city. That way you're not getting lost. Because I would get lost all the time because I didn't know the areas. Of course, there's GPS and all this stuff. But you don't know the different areas because it's like broken into. Got a little popcorn shell in my throat. I've been eating popcorn. I've been eating popcorn on the side. I got a little corner. Corner in my throat. Yeah, research your city. That way you have an idea of what area you're in. Because certain areas be bad. I'm trying to tell you, you get shot. Get a hobby in order to make friends. Because it is very hard to make friends out here. Because LA is a very transient city. Like, people are always moving in, moving out. So, I would definitely say, like, you know, get a, in order to meet new friends and stuff like that, get a hobby. And something in your field, whether you're acting, whether you're doing music, whether you're just out here, do dodgeball or something like that. Like, do a hobby with people that you like and then you know you'll find your friend group and stuff like that but i'm warning you like it's very hard out here to make friends because la is very transient like so many people move in and constantly it's a revolving door of people moving in and out in la that's just how the city works it's city living and my last tip would be is to have a um like once you get like settled in and all that stuff have a good work-life balance because sometimes the city is so grinding 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 sometimes you forget to live uh, have a good work-life balance. That way you're not going crazy all the time. Like, cause this city is like close to hustle. People are always constantly working, working, grinding, grinding. But it's important to have a good work-life balance. You know, don't, you know, live life. Important to live life and stuff. Those are my tips. Take it or leave it. Like, I want y'all to do better than what I did. Have a better experience than what I did moving out here. Like, have you some money saved up? Cause stuff is always going wrong. Like, stuff is happening. So be prepared. The best advice is to be prepared for the um, per perceptiveness of what might happen. 
You might not understand what I was saying, but you got the point. You got the message. But anyway, that's my video for today. Have a good day. Subscribe, like, you know, hook your boy up. Like, comment for videos. I'm trying to do weekly videos now. Uh, so, yeah. Boom. Have a good day, y'all. Much love. Peace out.